Welcome on board everyone. Today we will be assisting you with assembling your IKEA Knox Halt using 3D Smart Manuals. Make sure to follow us on socials. Links down below. To assemble this piece of furniture you will be only needing a hexagon key, a hammer, and a screwdriver. Make sure to have a carpet underneath you before emptying the box. The box will contain a set of 12 long thick screws, a set of 6 screw 35mm, a set of 3 screws 12mm, a set of 2 small screws, a set of 19 euro screws bolts, a set of 12 drawer rail screws, and a set of 6 cam lock screws. You will also get 4 cam lock nuts, 2 cam lock fasteners, 3 metal mounting bracket plate, 3 keyhole brackets, 1 angled connecting support, 27 nails, 6 push open hinge, 6 hinges, 2 pairs of the railing, 1 drawer reinforcement brackets, 24 standard wooden dowels, 2 thin wooden dowels, 2 pens, 5 bolts, 5 feet support, a hex key and 12 metal inserts. Take the two side pieces. Insert on the bottom of each piece a bolt and foot holder from the sets of five and tighten them using a hammer and repeat the same process on either side of both parts. Insert in the bottom inner corners of each side piece two chem lock screws from the set of six, secure them using a screwdriver. Insert the metal mounting brackets and using four screws from the set of 19 and screwdriver, secure them. Add two wooden dowels on either side of the back piece. Attach the bottom piece and one of the side pieces while making sure that the wooden dowels are perfectly aligned with the screws. Add two cam lock nuts and fasten the bottom and side pieces together using two cam lock fasteners and a screwdriver. Now we take the side holders and add four wooden dowels to the outer holes. Attach the holders to the bottom while making sure that the two holes are facing upwards and tighten them using a hex key and two long thick screws. Add a holder vertically while making sure that the dowels are inserted in the holes. We take another set of holders and attach on one of them the remaining metal mounting bracket plate with two small screws from the set of 19. Add the two wooden dowels in the same manner as the previous holders, attach them to the back and the vertical holder while making sure the wall fixer is facing the back. Secure them using four screws and tighten with the hex key. Take the two thin long holders and insert a wooden dowel on each side, put them on the facing side which is the top from this perspective, and insert six small screws. Using another long holder, add in the middle a bolt and foot support. Insert to the top a keyhole bracket and secure using a hex key. Put four wooden dowels on each side with which you will be adding the holder to the back. Secure using a small screw from the set of three and a screwdriver. Add the other side piece that was prepared in the second step. Insert it with two long screws, two comb lock nuts. Attach the back piece, insert 17 nails in the circumference of the back and hammer them in. Insert as well another 10 nails in the middle of the back aligning them with the holders. Insert a pair of the railing, add the top counterpiece. Insert the six long screws from the set of six, and fasten using a screwdriver. Attach the furniture to the wall using a screw and tighten them. Add on each side of the front holders two hinges and secure them using six screws. Add two on each door two push open hinges. Put in place the doors while aligning the push open hinges with the corresponding ones on holders. Finally, insert the 12 metal inserts inside the cabinets and add the three shelves inside. We move on to the drawer, add on the inside of the front piece two chrome lock screws, and insert on the drawer side pieces the two thin wooden dowels. Insert the side pieces to the front of the drawer, add the two chrome lock nuts, and fasten using a screwdriver. Add in the middle of the drawer the reinforcement bracket, slide the bottom and back pieces, and secure using two thick screws and hammer. Insert the remaining inside pairs of the railings, secure them using six small screws, and slide your drawer in the cabinet.
voila! Your IKEA Knox Halt is ready. Thank you for watching. Leave a thumbs up if you find the video helpful and don't forget to subscribe.